Yeah, oi, oi, tudo bom? Learn more, learn more, and now. Oh, I'm live! Oh my God, I'm live already. I'm live, and I'm going to, wait. I don't know if the camera is right. Well, I am happy today because I'm doing something different. Wait, let's go to my YouTube channel and check if I am really live. Oh, I have to fix the camera still. Taking a while. Well, I'm earlier. I'm earlier today. What is this? Well, I thought I changed the camera, but no, I didn't. I didn't change the camera. I think now, I think now it's changed. Let's see. Yes. Yeah, now I think I'm there. Oh, not bad. I'm in the very center. The mirror is there. The light is here. Let's take off the sound. Let me tell you something. Today I fixed my light. Because remember I told you my light was always on my right. So I had this shadow. So today I fixed, I, I, with tapes, I put the, the light right in front of my face and my mirror like that. I don't have any shadow, but maybe you're gonna see in a different way. I don't know if you can see shadows. I don't think so. You can see my old skin, that's for sure. Oh my God, I, I can see that. But anyway, let's not talk about old skin. Let's talk about beautiful skin. I already did my, you know, the base, the brows, and uh, when I, I was drawing my brows, I realized that they were really thick. But I, like, I liked the shape and the curve. I liked it. So that's normal. When you do, you draw. But at least for me, I'm talking about myself, huh? not about another um, YouTubers or makeup artists. I told you I've never studied. Uh, my makeup is, you know, it's something that is improving all the time. It's not glamorous, perfect, but I try my best, but I've learned by myself. The thing is, I always draw with powder, sometimes with um, pencils like that, you know, lip pencil or whatever I, I get. And after I give the right shape, normally I start with this, this technique of three points, like one point here, one here and one there, where I, where I want the, the brows to start, to curve, and to end. And after I connect them uh, with a flat brush, I blend the, the color I, I've got, and I get the, the, the right shape. If it's too thick and it's not perfect, it's all right, because now you're gonna take a little bit of foundation and you, are going to correct it. That's how we get the right shape. You see? How is already different? Not bad, not bad, but I don't like this brush. What, what? I think I did something wrong with the brush, really. 
I just found a very, very tiny brush. I think it's much better than this one. This one is a miracle. It's a very old brush, flat and uh, small. And I always can, you know, come to these corners and do the details I want. I don't know if you saw my last makeup, the makeup I did last week. Well, I don't know. I think I destroyed the... the shape. Anyway, we always can't come back. Well, last week, but last week, the last makeup was green. And you know what? I was thinking to do green again today, but you know, use different details or get some different stuff. Let's see. I'm still thinking. I must confess that brows are not my thing. To get them right, it's not easy. I think they're still thick. Oh, I start watching Hollywood. You know, I don't have net 
Netflix, but my friend, live, uh, my, our brother, my friend, we are living for years together now. Hi. And uh, he has the, um, the Netflix, Flix, <laughs> Flick. And we started, yes, my brother, R Hi, and me. And my God, I love this series. Oh, I see the curve here is missing. It's too round. Let's see if I can fix it. Better, but not yet bad. I don't know about you if you are watching. Hollywood. Oh my God, I love it. You know, it's like I told you two days ago about uh, the ghost of Marilyn Monroe, the video I did. And I must tell you, a lot of people comment, left some comments. And of course, I already had some haters, like always. Well, I think it's dramatic enough. Yeah, I think so. Um, let's see if someone is watching my video. watching but no comments that's all right so like this I, ha I can stay concentrate and do my things doing my things mm, uh, so I don't know I really don't know what kind of colors I'm gonna use because you know what I liked the makeup I did last time but at the same time I have um, a color that I liked because I used green last time, but I ha I've got some um, greasy green, which is very, very interesting to use as a base. And I want to do this, this base. Well, it's a funny, it's a funny brow, dramatic. I like it. You know, the more I watch some young queens doing their makeup, my God, I'm always amazed, always amazed the way they work, the way, also the way they are free. That's why I decided to do lately, try new things. And I'm very happy with the results because, you know, I'm, I am doing something out of my comfort zone, if you know what I mean. Because most of us, when we learn something, you know, we, we stay the same way because we are afraid to try new things and um, 
oh no, maybe if I do something different, it's gonna it's gonna be not nice. And uh, I think we have to to try there. But I always tell to some queens, it's um, as soon as you finish your makeup show or whatever, you did a makeup, you you did some pictures. I don't know. You had fun and when you're about to take off your makeup before doing it try to to create something this is the moment you really can try because you're gonna take away your makeup anyway so if you do something that you don't like it doesn't matter because it's gonna get off you know you know what i mean and that's a moment you can really try different things and i like it i did a lot tests So this is the white by MAC Studio Fix. With a flat a brush. Let's see what's happening here. Yeah, you see, I'm, I'm really trying something different. Because normally what I was doing, uh, I was adding the creamy white under the brows. I've done this for years. And after, white powder on the top of it. So it's white plus white. And um, it was really uh, a white uh, part. It was becoming really white. And when you, you were adding your colors and everything, it was okay to mix it, but if you didn't mix or blend it, I don't know, I don't know what, how to explain. It was still, at least when I was doing my pictures, I could see this white. see um i told green so this is the green i use for years i've got blue the blue is not here is at chamamon but it's a creamy makeup by grimace grimace is a dutch uh, company they produce a lot of things for a theater for a cinema it's quite popular here in belgium at least for some artists and uh, this is a creamy makeup. You can paint your face with it, or you can create also um, your shadows with it. So yes, last time I was doing my my eyes, I used creamy makeup. No, 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 no. 
I used powder, um, eyeshadows in powder, and um, I didn't like it. So, oh God, I don't know if I already give this shape. With the green. You know, I'm, I'm just using the creamy, the green, as a base. So the, the, the powder can stick on it. That's the idea. I'm just doing the lines, you know, to in order to to see where I'm going. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. something here that I'm gonna delete erase right now Here we go. Yes, here we go. Don't be scared. Just be free. I've got a beautiful yellow. <laughs> so, where are the colors right now? Yes, here. 
But you know what? Today, I'm going to be clever because last time I didn't do that. Let's go. Let's see what I am going to do. Here we go. My nose start to What am I getting? <laughs> Something surreal.
Well, let's see. I've got several blendy brushes here. But I don't know which one I was using last time. See if someone is watching or asking something to me. No one. Kimberly Spring. Oh, hello, beautiful. Hello, Kimberly. How are you, darling? How are you doing today? We are in the middle of the week already. In the middle of the week. So I decided to do several live videos, three live videos a week. So I decided Monday, Wednesday and Friday.
Oh, I've got more, more, more comments. Sara Lima, acabei de chegar. Sara Lima, bem-vinda. Kimberly Spring, I am well. I'm wondering how are you doing? Well, darling, I'm doing good. Thanks. I'm doing fine. Um, I decided to go back to work and uh, face life as we should do. In the beginning of this crisis, I was... I was down, I must confess, I was really down because you know, as a drag artist, we all lost our jobs. Not, not only drag artists, a lot of artists, most of the artists. I have a friend here in Belgium, he's an opera singer. He just sent me a message yesterday and he told me that he lost his job Thanks God, it was official job. So he still he he gets he gets paid for the moment, but he was really really down. Opera singer, can you imagine us, drag queens? But you know what? I decided, as I told you, I decided to to fight it. Now I'm back because we can move. So I'm back to my atelier. I, I don't live far from here. So I come here. I start doing my lives, my live videos. And uh, it helps me a lot because I produce, I do my stuff, I do my makeup, I, I, I stay in contact with you guys and it's great. Kimberly, in Texas, USA, the clubs have been closed for seven weeks. Yes, darling, oh my God. And we are told we will be the last business to be open again. How are you doing with the missing Shimamo? Yes, darling, oh my God, yeah. We are going to be the last ones. Well, Shimamo, it's a small place. It's a very small bar. And uh, the thing is, I really think we are gonna be the last ones. I have, like I, could, like I told you, friends working in, in opera. So he said it's gonna be closed, the opera. And uh, I have another friend, he's a manager in a big theater, a very famous theater in, in Brussels, traditional theater. And he also said they're gonna stay close. No season, summer, close, closed. So I don't know what we're gonna, we are gonna do because Shemamo, as I told you, is a small bar and I don't think they're gonna open it. You're gonna stay close till September. Oh my God, this is dramatic. This is really dramatic. Ooh. Oh God. You know, that's what is nice when I'm doing live videos and you guys ask me things. You know, ah, you ask me, how is she? Maman is in France because she was there before the, 
the crisis. She took off for one month. She took kind of holidays, and I was I, I was replacing her with with the other queens. Um, so two weeks before, no, no, I was supposed to to work two weeks more, and she was coming back, and then we had the. The beginning of the crisis, the bars were closed, and we had to to close everything down. So she was in France; she could come, she couldn't come in. So she's still in France, but you know, she's working, she has a house there, so she's working in the house with her, with her husband, because she, she has a husband, you know, and they are working, she said she's doing fine, and out of drag for so long, that means he has long beard now, and uh, he said he's enjoying his uh, boy side for a while because he said he's he, he never done that in almost 30 years. He never stayed so long without, without doing drag. And that's amazing because can you imagine for someone who is doing drag for 30 years, never off, only on, on holidays, but like three months, two months, only with the boy look can be really, really strange. He sent me a picture with a long beard. I said, oh my God. Who are you? Because it looked so different. Oh my God, I am doing something that I never did. I think this makeup will be really different. You know what, it's a kind of uh, silent movie star. Just trying to lift up a little bit the eye because it was too down.
really strange this makeup. Kimberly, are you in the contact with the other girls? Good question, darling. Yes, we, we kind of, we have a, because you know, we live far from each other and some even live out of Brussels, but we talk to each other to see how we are doing. Like Marla lives in France, not far from Belgium, but she, she lives in the north of France. We, we exchange messages and um, yeah, Facebook and, and internet helps a lot. We try our best. I noticed in your short story video that your hair has grown quite a bit during the crisis. Your dark waves are very sexy. Have you considered lifting your hair, uh, uh, letting your hair grow long? Oh, darling, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I had uh, for years long hair. I cannot complain. I have good air, hair. But it's it was dark, curve, you know, wave. Not straight, straight. But it was kind of wave, and um, I, I, I had when I was young. I was always with long hair. Always, you know. I grew up in the 70s. We loved long hair. But lately, no. For more than 20 years, I think. My hair is long or short. You never let let grow back a lot of people they like it when it's long but i don't know it's too much work oh my god that's really really dramatic So I don't know, I don't, I don't, really don't know if I'm going to let my hair grow. And you know, it's really, as you told, it's full of white and gray. Not full, but I'm, I'm because, well, it's a good, uh, you know, um, I have grays everywhere. It's not only one part. So that's why some, sometimes people, they don't see my gray hair. They say, do you paint, do you dye your hair? In black? No, no, it's full of gray if you pay attention because they think it's kind of um, my, my hair is shining, but now it's becoming really, really more and more, more and more, really gray and white hair. Yes, darling, I'm gonna turn 53 this year, 53 years old. 
So you do watch my stories. That's cool. Because I don't know, I was I was doing my stories. I don't know if people watch it or what. Sorry. Let's dry that a little bit because otherwise I cannot move my eyes. Well, this is the eyeliner and it's gonna be very, very soft. See, I got a little print there. But it's a good sign because I know I have to go with black in this part where I get the print. What is the question? Let's check. Let's check. Uh, 52 never looked so good before. You are an amazing youthful beauty. Oh, Kimberly, you are just an angel. 
Do you have an outfit already chosen when you start such dramatic eyes? Um, yes, I had. I had a, I had some idea because you know I'm posting a lot of very short dresses, and uh, I said I think I'm gonna show off my legs again. So I have a short dress that I'm planning to wear. It. But normally I I do choose before not easy amethyst amethyst hey how are you darling welcome welcome don't be scared huh? this is not a horror makeup it was supposed to be dramatic but not that dramatic mm. um sure about some stuff but Mm-hmm. You know what? I'm losing control. I will stop. Otherwise, I'm gonna go too far. Um, let's try to fix a cut crease.
lot of people are writing me. Let's check what you are writing. Um, Amethyst, say hello. Kimberly, hello, Amethyst. Oh, nice you are talking to each other, my darlings. That's a family, and I'm very happy to see you guys like that. Oh, hello, Sarah. Wow, hello. Star Gemini, Star, how are you? My God, it's ages we don't talk to each other. Oi, querido. Queia Souza, manda um oi em português para mim. Eu te mando um super beijo. Bem-vinda. Queia Souza, bem-vinda, querida. Gostou do beijo? Hello, Star. Hola, Keia. Oi, Kimberly. My darlings, so nice to see you here talking to each other. No, oh, really, I'm really touched. That's really, really cool. Queens around the world, together, enjoying. Oh my God, it's Star, it's a long time, really. Star Jiminy. Wait, because maybe I'm gonna say her name in the wrong way. No, Jemina. It's because I've got an accent. She is um, watching my videos since the very, very beginning. And so sweet. How are you, Star? I hope you are doing fine. You're in Sweden, aren't you? I heard in, Swed in Sweden they were not doing um, a very tough uh, quarantine. I don't know if it's working for you guys. You know, every country took different decisions. Here in Belgium, we started long time ago the, the quarantine. And I think it was a good idea. when my nose does that always when when I'm here look ah, it's awful
Oh God. Who wrote a big message? Kimberly, many countries here. I think maybe we should solve some word problems as a side item to this lovely makeup. Kimberly, I think they are from everywhere around the globe. We've got Brazil, we've got Sweden, Belgium somewhere. hate my nose like that. Oh my God. That's really, really dramatic. I, oh my God. And I don't know what's happening lately when I do my eyeliner. And after I've got, um, my eyes cry you know i don't know why maybe because i'm doing makeup you know all the time now well last time i used glitter but this time i think i'm gonna use something different something simple It's a powder that I bought in a shop here in Brussels. Shimmery. Really shimmery. It's beautiful. Well, now it's up to up.
Well, I just opened it a lot because I'm gonna wear my false eyelashes and the false eyelashes always make this white part disappear. That's the only reason I did that. I was watching a YouTuber, I don't know her name, a young girl, and she was opening um, a box she got from NYX, a box full of goodies, beautiful things, oh my god. I wonder when I'm gonna get present like that. Never. You know, I just got once a box full of beautiful things from Cryolan because I won a contest. That's why. Otherwise, I never, 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 never got products for free. Never. I want to blend, but don't blend. You want to blend, but don't blend blends. Yes. That's always the drag, drag queen um, tip. Sometimes it's really, really confusing. Blending and blending and blending.
Well, if this is not dramatic, I don't know what you call dramatic. My God, I'm like a North Star from Hollywood. Well, I think it's enough. Let's go for the... What is it? What is it? My false eyelashes. Here, here they are. I don't know if you saw the video I posted on Instagram. I don't know if you follow my Instagram, but I've got an Instagram. And I also have a Facebook. Some people write me asking if I have a, th those accounts. I do. You have to check them. When you open my YouTube page, you will see all the social medias I've got. Right there. So if you want to follow them, just check my first YouTube page and you will see. I was watching my live video from this week, from two days ago, and it's so crazy to watch my uh, transformation because it's completely different. The colors, a lot of things change when you see a video on YouTube. Really, it changed a lot. The color, everything changed. The original color, I mean, the blending, everything, contouring. I was happy when I was doing my live video talking about the ghost, the Marilyn Monroe's ghost. I liked the makeup. The makeup was nice in the, in the, in the video, on the video. But it's it's not the same. It's really not the same. I mean, it was beautiful, but it's different. Life is different. Of course, when you do a drag makeup, when you are on stage, because normally my makeup, my technique of makeup, 
it's made for a stage. It's not, my makeup is not made for real life, not at all. If you meet me live, for real, you're gonna be astonished, you're gonna be afraid. You're gonna run five days, so afraid. Because my makeup is really, really strong. But when you watch my videos and you see my pictures, it looks fine. It looks normal. It looks soft. It looks so natural. But it's not natural at all. You will, you will say, what are, what are you saying, sugar? That your makeup is scary. Yes, yeah, a kind of scary. I'm obsessed with those little pieces of bra um, hair. I cut it um, several, not several, but let's say two false eyelashes. And they are kind of um, thick ones. So I had to cut. And I cut it in several pieces. And what I do now, I place them in the outer corner of the eyes, under the waterline. And like this, I get um, special effects, dramatic effects. It makes you really more silent movie star should place this more in the outer corner. Or maybe there is. Today is a very, very sunny day in Brussels. Beautiful day. And I think it's gonna stay like this for days now. And uh, you know, a lot of people, they complain, especially my Belgian friends, people born here. I can't say that I'm almost a Belgian because I'm living here for 30 years. But my, my friends, born here some of them they are always complaining and saying belgium it's uh, has a terrible weather always raining always gray sky skies it was like this not anymore not anymore now we've got beautiful springtime beautiful summer beautiful autumn Let's see. Ooh. You want you want really glam. I 
I don't have any idea what week I'm going to wear it today. Oh, this nose is really ooh, terrible. Well, the eyes are like this, and they will stay like this. <laughs> Run five days here, yeah, yeah. you will. You're gonna be so scared. No, I'm joking, I'm not that ugly. Mm. I really think something is missing. Oh yes, yes, I've got a beautiful, beautiful product. I can even, no, no, I cannot tell you the name because the name is gone. But it's a, an eyeliner, silver eyeliner. And I think it would be nice if I, ha I, I add a little touch of silver here. Why not? Yeah, why not? And why not even a little bit of glitter? Why not? I don't know what happens. This is a MAC glitter, very expensive one. But always, when I try to open my <laughs> the container, it's a mess. Oh God. It's a beautiful color. There is some green on it. Look, I just had the cover right in front of my face and I don't find it. Oh my God. Here. I don't know if you can see, but this is the thing. Beautiful, beautiful. Who wrote something? Stevens, hello Stevens, welcome, welcome, well now I'm not quite
sure about my brows. Yeah. They are too long. Yeah. I think that's what is not nice about it. Really too long. Yeah, I think it's better. Well, it's missing a lot of things, you know. Stevens, I want to call, I wanted you to call me Monshu. You want me to call you. What do you want to talk about? You can say everything here. We are free people. You just right there, write something, we're going to answer you live my darlings can you imagine i'm answering you live um, let's go for my lips what about lips what kind of lips you want me to have today big lips well last week i did a big lips It was kind of nice, but let's see what I'm gonna do today. And of course, I use pink. Yeah, some pink. Well, this is big lips.
Last week, um, I did my lips like that. I, I used this pencil, or kind of red pencil, after I blended a lot, and I used kind of pink lipstick, creamy lipstick. So I got an effect, a very nice effect. This is already too big. It's really big. That's what I did. Somebody wrote me. Kimberly, I suspect that the eye, the eyes line is causing the allergic reaction is sugar. You know what? Me too. I think the same, you know? Because this is a kind of a new eyeliner that I use. Mm-hmm. Well, they're really big, huh? So for the lips also, for example, if you think your lips are too big, the shape is not right, I already told you a lot of times, you take some foundation, a flat, small brush, and you correct. You cut the parts you don't like, the parts you think is too big,
like so. For instance, I think this part under is too big. The magic foundation You see? Mm -hmm. And I think I even can go there. Much better. And what I did last time was a kind of, um, I've learned with that this friend of mine, Juninho. Some white right in the center. What about that? Well, eyes are done, lips are done. Because I've got this palette. Yes, this is it. It's a lipstick palette.
Big lips, madam. Ooh. Yes. Why not? Now, my darlings, I will start my blush. But this time, I'm not going to use the shimmery thing. I've got this palette also from Crayolan which has a little bit of shimmery. Just want to check if this shimmery here, the brown is shimmery. Look, this beautiful palette, beautiful. Um, Kimberly, I have noticed other girls glue eyebrows, then foundation, then contouring, then eye and lips. Do you have a certain order? Um, what I do, yes, yes, I, I have a kind of order. It's like a ritual. When I do, normally, but today I broke my ritual. What I do is like that. I glue my eyelashes. I pass, I put on the glue. I leave it there to dry. Then I do, I start my contouring. Today I didn't do it, I don't, I don't know why. But normally I do like that.
do you, Kimberly, do you have a secret for how to combat the heat and perspiration from the wig? Oh, darling, no. Well, wigs are always very, very hot. Things to, I mean, they make you hot. Summertime is terrible to wear. What I do, I put some elastic, some caps like that, and my wig. No, I don't have anything, anything at all. What we always do is a fan. Carry a fan with you. Because you're gonna get hot. This is our thing. The nose. Everybody asked me, I already showed you a lot of times how I do my nose.
and a white dot. Well, this is a very thin nose. Oh my God, what time is it? I started at one or before. Is this is three o'clock already? Oh God, three o'clock. I thought I was going fast with this new makeup, but on the contrary. <laughs> well, it's different when I do a makeup here. I stop a lot, I talk to you guys.
Well, 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 I guess I am done. Now, as always, I will change, I will put on my wig, um, my contact lenses, and um, let's see, I don't know if I choose, I, I have something that, that I want to try, I'm not that sure, but I'm going to get dressed and I will come back like in 20 minutes, so like always you have the time to go to the kitchen, make your coffee, your chocolate or whatever you want to drink, some drinks, and after you come back because we're going to talk about something. I really don't know what I'm going to talk about. I thought about makeup. Hi, you get periods. Hi, you get periods. Periods. What kind of periods are you talking about? If I get periods. Mm. Do you know what I am? Do you know my work? Is it the first time you are here? Um, do you know drag queens? What they do? What they are? I don't think so. Thanks, Kimberly. My God, you are from the very beginning. Huh? You saw the entire thing, Kimberly. You were a strong girl today. So that's it. A lot of green. I use this green by Grimace. This is a powder makeup. I use this green. It's also from Grimace and it's creamy. So I mixed them, you know, I used green under and after, well, I created the entire cut crease with this green and after, I'm not lying, I'm gonna tell you the truth. I used NYX, that green, that strong green to get, you know, more effect. And after, you know, black and um, blending and mixing all of them. Lips I created with this pencil, always with a pencil, I blend out. And after I add some color, I use some, you know, kind of pink or nude. And this is it. For the contouring, I use very strong contouring right up here. Because, you know, I wear a lot of my wigs. They are lace front wigs. And I like to, you know, do a very strong contouring always here to get, you know, kind of to blend very well the wig, the front, lace front and everything. Um, those false eyelashes that I cut and I used, I'm wearing this for a while and I like the effect they give. Very thick eyeliner, of course, here. And what? I think this is it. There's no new stuff. And, uh, I had a friend also, she, once she asked, oh, you never do the, the fixing. I'm gonna fix this with a very, very cheap makeup fix. I got Mac, but my Mac is not here. It's at Shimano. So I'm gonna fix my makeup with this one. It's great. What do you think? I like it. Very dramatic indeed. Um, Kimberly, clapping hands for your beautiful makeup. Thank you so much, Kimberly. I'm so happy that you like it. Thank you so much. Um, I hope you you had you had some ideas for you also. 
Oh, the blushing. The blushing I used um, some pink. Not a lot of colors, you know? Pink and... Um, some... No, basically it was pink. And some orange also. That's what I used. Love, love the silver eyeliner in the inner corners. Thank you, Kimberly. We know I mixed also. It's not only eyeliner. I mix with some glitter. And that's it. Well, I would like to, you know, in the inner corner, choose another kind of thing. I was thinking to use some glitter, but I gave up in the end. But that's it. So now, my darlings, I am going to change myself and I will come back. Marmar Grade, bonjour ma femme de ma vie, bonjour Marmar, how are you, baby? Comment ça va? J'espère que ça va bien. Ça fait longtemps. Tu arrives toujours à la fin, Marmar. Qu'est-ce que tu fais? Tu dormais? Tu faisais la siesta? Maintenant, j'ai presque fini mon maquillage. Hein? Non, non, j'ai fini mon maquillage. So, my darlings, uh, while, meanwhile, when I will get dressed, I will choose my dress and everything, I'm gonna think about what I'm, we are going to talk about. You know, I was thinking to, to talk about the YouTube channel, my work here, but I, I, I think I spoke already about that, how I started my YouTube channel. And uh, maybe you're gonna talk about makeup. Yes, makeup, ideas, where I get my inspirations, where I did some, yeah, stuff like that. Let's talk about makeup. Ah, tu dormais, hein, Marmar? Ah, oh, je savais, je savais que tu dormais. Ça va bien, mon chou, ça va très bien. Je suis presque fini. Maintenant, c'est changé et je vais retourner pour parler de quelque chose. Ça va? Um, I will think about it, okay? So, basically, we are going to talk about makeup, but I will think what exactly. Maybe a little bit of everything. All right. So, I will go right now. You come back later. Okay, my darlings? In 20 minutes time, when I'm gonna be in full drag, all right? So, see you, bye.